name is uh, Eric Phipps and I'm with Junction Networks and OnSIP.com. Uh, today we actually just rolled out a great new feature for the Grandstream GXP2140 and 2160 phone. So I wanted to take a little bit of time to talk to you about it and show you how it actually works. Uh, what we've done is we've turned on uh, the local call recording um, to USB uh, for the Grandstream GXP2140 and 2160 phones. Um, you can also, if you do not have a USB, uh, you can actually also record directly to the phone. But we don't know how much space is on that phone, so we really don't recommend it because we'd hate for you to have to go try and record a call and then find out that you don't have enough space to actually do it. So let me go ahead and just show you a little bit about uh, what we're talking about. So we're going to be using a Grandstream 2160 uh, phone here. And what you'll need to do is you'll find like a little rubber thing on the bottom, or on the back rather, uh, and this is where the USB goes. It just pulls right out and you can just move it off to the side. You probably don't want to pull that out too much because that could, uh, you could lose that. And what you're going to do is you're going to take this little slot and you're going to slide it in. Um, this is going to, this might be a little tricky because it is like one of those that is retractable, but let's see if we can get it in. So you'll push it in, and if your USB is the kind that lights up to, to say that it's in, you'll see that it's lit, lit up. Um, but also, more importantly, on the phone itself, you'll see that there is now uh, the USB indicator right there. All right, so let's go ahead and make a call. Uh, we're going to make a call to uh, someone else in the knock named John, and let's see what happens. Hello? Hey John, it's Eric and I'm doing the uh, demonstration now. Alright, so as you can see on the call, uh, we now have a button that says record on. So to start the recording, you'll just need to hit this button and then everything that we say is being recorded. And you can see that it says that it's recording locally. Um, and I haven't checked this myself, so we'll see. Yep, and as you can see, uh, the little USB light is going crazy, just indicating that data is being di written directly to it. Okay, John, so uh, I'm going to actually, well, actually, before I hang up, uh, you'll see that you have the option to turn the recording off. Um, so if you wanted to uh, stop the recording at any time beyond just hanging up, you can just hit that button and it will stop recording. Uh, but what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and hang up. Thanks for answering, John. Okay, you're welcome. All right, and then what we can do is we can actually take the USB stick directly out of the back of the phone. We'll plug it into my handy-dandy waiting laptop here. All right, you just pop in the USB stick. And then you can click on it. You can see your WAV file. You can see the phone number that we dialed. You can see the time that the phone call took place according to the display time on the phone. For whatever reason, the uh, call is set as actually recorded at uh, UTC time, so that's always going to be uh, wrong unless you live in that magical window. And then when you're done, all you have to do is just to uh, check the, uh, the thumb drive, and you can just plug it directly into the phone, as we'll show you. So you'll just in eject it, put it right back in. And you'll see that the USB thing has popped up again and it is actually ready to record so you don't need to worry about like ejecting it or anything like that you can just totally hot swap it pull it out to uh, save or listen to whatever recordings or um, archive them and then just put the drive right back in um, so we don't there's not really a lot of information on the Grandstream site about what you'll need to do in order to um, like the types of USB cards that are acceptable or how much space is on the uh, the phone for uh, internal recording or so on and so forth. So what we've done is we've just gone ahead and turned on like the USB drive. Um, also, uh, you may want to be aware before you start recording every call willy-nilly of whatever the, uh, you know, the local laws are for recording phone calls. And I believe that uh, if it goes interstate that the, you need to respect the uh, calls of the opposite end of the state. But I'm not a lawyer. I'm just here to do a tech demo. Uh, so yeah, that is something that you do want to be aware of. All right, so we hope that you found this very informative, and we hope that you find this uh, very helpful going forward. Have a great day.